What's up with the fam? It's your boy Preston McCullough Jr. here. Back at it again with another video. So fam, uh, right now I'm on this journey where I'm reading through the Bible, front to back. This is the first time I've ever done that. But you know, with me coming back into the faith, I wanna make sure I got a complete understanding of the story of the Bible. Throughout this research, I think that YouTube kind of picked up on the fact that I've been researching the Bible and I've been deeper into Christianity, deeper into my faith, believing in Jesus, you know what I'm saying? And YouTube has been sending me a whole lot of religious content. I mean, I'm hearing Catholic priests uh, give different testimonies about exorcisms that they have performed. You know, I'm hearing uh, different Satanists that used to, you know, people who used to worship Satan and believe in Satan and uh, how they, you know, how they had come to Christ. Um, I'm hearing different uh, Jewish rabbis talk about God in the Old Testament and you know, uh, in the way that they believe. I'm hearing Muslims, you know, give, I guess, I wouldn't say testimony. I'm not really hearing a lot of testimony from the different uh, Muslims that have come across my algorithm. But um, it's crazy. Like, I don't know if that's an attack from the devil uh, to, to try to sow confusion. But um, I will say, you know, as I hear these different perspectives on religion and faith, right? Um, excluding the ex-Satanists that turned to Christ, right? Not not including him. But, you know, the Catholic priest, the the Jewish rabbi, the I'm not, I'm not sure what you call the 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 the, the, high, the like a high-ranking preacher in Islam. I'm not sure what you call that. But just th th these different religions, right? These different religious leaders giving their explanation of God and, 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 and their faith. It, it's kind of hard for me to believe that everybody's, everybody else is going to hell. Although since the Bible says, you know, that the only way is through Jesus Christ, he is the way, the truth and the light. I believe that, you know what I mean? But as I hear these people talk and I'm hearing just how much they really believe and how much work and time and effort that they put into their faith it like it's it's unfortunate to believe that let me just put it like that but i do believe it you know what i mean but i don't know if all of these different perspectives are coming to me as an attack from from the devil to try to get me to dive deeper into these other religions or if it's okay to hear different perspectives i'm not sure about that again i'm i'm coming back into the faith i'm i'm, I'm still a, a, a fairly young christian you know but it's crazy and it sounds hypocritical to me. I know that God, I know that the God of the Bible is true. I know that Jesus is true. And we have a calling on our life to go out there and and convert other people into into share the gospel, right? And then just hope that they would actually try the Bible uh, and try faith, right? But is it hypocritical the fact that I'm actually terrified? I'm terrified to death to try one of these other religions, to, to, to read through the Quran, to read through the Torah. You know, like, uh, it's scary because I don't know if I want to read, you know, what's in these other religious texts and possibly my faith not be strong, and my, my faith may or may not be strong enough to be able to discern, to discern the difference. You know what I mean? I don't want to become sympathetic to other faiths and other religions when right now the path I'm on is telling me that the only way is through Christ. So that's kind of what I'm going through now, you know, and uh, my understanding of what Catholics believe, a lot of Catholics do believe in Jesus Christ. I'm not sure if all of them believe that Jesus Christ is the only way. I'm not sure I've heard different reviews on, on both sides. Some, some Catholic priests believe that there's multiple different ways to, to, to get to Christ from my understanding. But one of the biggest things that, that you know, that kind of has me thinking is the fact that the Catholic Bible has more books in it than the Christian Protestant Bible, right? I have no idea what that book is called, but that was just something that I learned throughout the, through the algorithm that came to me. I've also heard that Catholics hold angels and saints in high regard. I've heard different people give reviews on on Catholics, but people who are not actually a part of the faith. And they, I've heard testimonies, or I've heard people talk about how Catholics actually worship a lot of these different 
I guess, beings that's not actually the, the, the Trinity. Now, I'm not sure if that's true because what I've heard from the Catholic priests that I, that just came across my algorithm is they absolutely do not believe in uh, worshiping angels and worshiping saints. They just hold them in high regard, right? So that's just one of the things that I've been kind of just working through. And I'm not sure if it's an attack from the devil or if I should be curious about other religions so that they can strengthen my faith. So what I'm going to do, fam, uh, just to be on the safe side, I'm just going to continue to read through the Bible. These things that come across my algorithm, I'm not going to say I'm going to click off because it is interesting, especially considering the fact that Catholic priests have been known to cast out demons, you know, uh, to actually perform exorcism. And God, you know, from my understanding, God actually gives them the power to cast out demons through them. So in my opinion, from what I know, just on the surface level, right? I don't see how Catholics go to, you know, that's another religion that's outside of, that's outside of uh, the Protestant Christianity. How do they go to hell if God has given them the power? Again, fam, don't attack me. I'm still new to this, but I'm just trying to understand, you know, like what's safe and what's not. But with that being said, fam, I'm gonna end this video right here. Uh, I would love your comments. I would love you guys to help to kind of guide me uh, with just, some positive feedback and I will use my discernment in that comment section, right? So if you the devil or if you somebody who's trying to steer me in the wrong way, I am, I'm, I'm, I'm going to be on the lookout for that. But that's all I got to say, fam. Thank y'all for watching. Holla at your boy.